and gentlemen and good morning YouTube good morning to all my subscribers and viewers uh, <laughs> today the boogeyman just dropped trailer 2 2023 uh, let's get it man I'm glad it's more I'm glad it didn't drop this at night because it would have been better to do this at night but they dropped it early in the morning I'm just like oh god I gotta do it fuck it let's get it when there are scary things we don't understand our minds try to fill in the blanks. Sometimes the best thing to do is to face it. Isn't so this light is going to be completely solid like it is right now. And then gradually, it's going to start flashing until it's totally dark. So you can see that there's nothing to be afraid of. Okay? Wait, isn't she that lady? They got thrown at the TV? See, that's not so scary, is it? Just you, your sister, and me. You're doing okay. It's not for you. It's okay. It's okay. Yeah, I just not seeing it paying attention to it. It's all just in your head. Stations. What is this supposed to be? It's the thing that comes for your kids when you're not paying attention. Dad, you have to listen to me. Okay. I'm listening. <laughs> Sweetheart, let me handle it. This he got snatched away. <laughs> oh wait, only in theaters June second. I'm going to see. You know, I'm going to see it because I'm a big fan of Stephen King. Every every book he put out, I remember reading when I was a kid. I don't think any book he made was really really bad in my in my opinion. Like at all. Like I'm I'm most definitely gonna give this a shot because Stephen King is obviously I think he's directing this. Is he directing this? If I let me know in the comment below, but I'm pretty sure he's directing this. But a lot of people are like, oh man, it's gonna be trash. I was like, bro, Stephen King has never put out no garbage <laughs> ever. Look at the remake of it. That movie was fire. I saw saw one chapter one and two, and they both were good. I, I mean, they did move a couple of things around, but other than that, it, it was still good. And Pennywise was a lot more scarier. In this one than he was in the original ones because he was a lot more creepy with the dance and all that and the only thing I didn't like about part two was that how they beat him without the turtle because the turtle was supposed to come and beat him but they beat him with the power of friendship I don't know if that actually really killed him that's gonna make him come back but with the boogeyman it's a different story I already gonna beat the boogeyman yeah, you know, I, I remember they, back in the day though they was already making Boogeyman movie, but Stephen King didn't write any of those. That was uh, those were uh, made by other people, and some of them were good, some of them was trash. I could, you know what? I thought I could probably type some in on YouTube and find them, but there was a lot of Boogeyman movies. Let's see. Yeah, that was a Boogeyman movie that came out in 2005. And then there was one more came out. Trying to see.
Now, that was another Boogeyman movie that came out. Who is like, the Boogeyman? Like the Boogeyman ago. is a legendary and very powerful creature, a tulpa, who was spawned by the nature of humans to be afraid of the unknown. He originally originated as an imaginary creature used by adults to intimidate children. He has no specific appearance, and the idea of him varies in the mythology of the peoples of the world. The Boogeyman is capable of taking any form. The Boogeyman lives in dark places, such as in a closet or under a bed. According to legend, only children can see the Boogeyman. The Boogeyman likes to scare naughty children, grabbing them by the legs and dragging them under the bed or into the closet, his lair. The most naughty of the children are taken by the Boogeyman to his nightmare kingdom and devoured. Most of all, the Boogeyman is afraid of the light, which can kill him, as well as the faith of adults. He is afraid that adults will be able to believe in him. Who is the boogie? Oh, so adults, since adults are old, they, they can't really affect him. Yeah. So if they were to believe, if the adults were to believe in him, they'll be able to find a way to kill him because children can't kill him, obviously. So that makes sense. Well, we all just got educated on the boogeyman in two seconds. I just literally typed in a video, to, like, it's been a while. But I mean, they made a lot of boogeyman movies, though. I could have sworn there was more than just one. Well, obviously, Stephen King Boogeyman verse is going to pop up a lot because everybody wants to go see see it. But, um, there was one more they made like a while back, dude. It was, it was, it was on Sapphire. And they were actually pretty good. I think they had like sequels. But it was like, it wasn't the real Boogeyman. It was like a, it was a human killing him. And he was like, it was like Ghostface almost. Like he was a scream. He was just like the scream of Boogeyman. And each, each Boogeyman movie was like a different killer. And they'll make you believe that the Boogeyman is real, but he's actually not. It's just a man killing him. So, try this. Okay, that's the 2005 version. I remember that one. And... Wow, they actually don't have it, I guess, because it's so old. Oh, wait, yeah, yeah, here it is. Lord found out the identity of the Boogeyman. Boogeyman 2. Yeah. I was about to say, been a whole bunch of them, mate. I guess the 2005 one is more common. I think that's the one that everybody likes the more. Hmm. Well, that's all we got, y'all. We learned a lot about the Boogeyman. I don't, I'm, I'm most definitely going to go see the movie because obviously I got to give you guys my reaction to it. But still, like, I, I I got faith in this movie. Like, Stephen King's trying to bring back horror. That's just, that's just my opinion. I don't know what everybody else's is, but I feel like he's going to revive a horror movie. But anyways, post comments down below. Make sure you give this video a like and subscribe to the channel, the Blissway channel. Give your boy 50, at least 50 likes. Hit that notification bell, and uh, we out of here, man. Let's check, let's check this gun on out, y'all.